Hola, mis amigos. Me llamo Hyuna. Bienvenidos a mi canal Anime Illuminati. Now, what do I want to say? Hold on, hold on. Ah, congratulations. Or was it F feliz felicidades? Whatever. A mi amigos en el México. Eh, equipo de México está aquí. We did it, baby. Team Mexico is here. Para celebración, yo voy a beber una cerveza de México. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Hold on, way. Corona. Look at this. I got you, boys. I bought one Corona just for this occasion. Yeah, I don't. I, they don't sell uh, Tecate. I know. I know Tecate and Modelo, right? Modelo, Modelo, Tecate, all that stuff. They don't sell it at Japanese uh, supermarkets. So all you get is a Corona. This is as Mexican as it gets. I'm sorry. Even look, even the writing on the back. I don't know if you can see it. Is all is all in Japanese. I'm sorry, but we can pretend that we're having a Mexican celebration. Of course, I got the lime, and I have very expensive equipment. So the camera's expensive, mic's expensive, computer's expensive. We're still gonna break it all. Ready? This never works. This never works. Ready? Get your Twitch clips ready. Oh, shit. Ready? Pop that in. Now you do a little flipperoo. Wait till that lime gets to the top. You see it? And now bring it back. Oh shit! It came back. Let the pressure out. Hey, easy. Salud. Saludos. Mm, I haven't had one of these in a while. But anyway, why am I talking about it? Why are we talking about this stuff? If you don't speak perfect Spanish like me, Ramon. Ramon has been announced for King Cross 15. Kind of, I guess, like a... I guess he's like a surprise pick, a rare pick. You know, we've been talking about it week after week. That we want to see some more rare characters. So here we go. You got Ramon from Team Mexico, which means... People talking about what? Angel? Angel is, is going to be coming now too. But, I mean, congratulations. I know you guys are hype. I know Mexico's got a huge Kev scene. So you guys are happy about that. I'm not. As promised, if you've been uh, if you're a new viewer, you might not know this. But if you've been around, you know I promised that I will be canceling my King of Fighters 15 pre-order if this character is ever added to the game. So like, we got a little clip. Let's do a little history lesson right now. Why would I do that? Why do I want to cancel? Why do I hate this character? Let's watch what kind of character Ramon is. So I mean, I'm the one on the right. I'm playing fair and honest Kasumi here. This is Ramon on the left. It's my first time fighting this guy. I've never fought. I've never seen him before. Here we go. Huh. 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 I thought I was playing Mugen right here. Look at this. I thought I'm playing Mugen. We got run stops, run stop, run stop. Guard break. What is that? CD knockdown in the super. The tiger spin or whatever. And then he keeps going again. Run stop, run stop. Look at this. What is this? Is this fair? Do I want to play? I want to do this again in KO15? I don't think so. <laughs> He's going to guard break me again. He's going to guard break me again. He doesn't even need to. And again, look, run, stop, and this time he just runs up and throws me. He just murdered me. Absolute destruction. So, yes, that was my experience. <laughs> That's the kind of character. So, of course, you know, I'm a scrub. Obviously, there's ways to escape that, but he's a very, very tricky character. Apparently, what people tell me, he's not even, like, he wasn't even good in 2K2, right? He's, he's like a, a scrub killer. So, get ready. I'm warning you now. If you're like me, you're looking forward to 15. This character right now, you might be up for the trailer, but you better get ready. Learn how to fight. Anyway, let's check it out. I was too scared. I haven't watched it yet. Traumatic PTSD against this character. So I was trying to put it off, but here we go. Please, tell me they took out Run Stop. Took that, take that block string out of the game. Come on, let's make a fair and honest. Let's make King of Fighters 15 fair and honest. But here we go. He got his uh, luchador suit, whatever. I don't know what it is, a body suit. He's got a scar on his eye. I don't know the deep lore right here. His Spanish is pretty good. It's better than mine. There. So, yeah, the wall jumps and stuff. I, was he a wall jump in 2K2, though? I don't remember dealing with that too much. And there's that Tiger Roar thing that messed me up. Bang! I guess because they don't show... Oh, he likes Mills, right? Isn't that... Yeah, isn't that the lore he likes Mills? But yeah, I guess... Since no one ever blocks in these, we're not going to see the blocks in infinites. But it looks like he still has all these these weird cancels. You see, like, that back stance. That's a command back stance, right? Or back, like, step. Jesus Christ. I like the point. I like that point. He's cool. <laughs> I don't know, man. You know what? This might be the Corona talking right now. Via Mexico! Oh. 
You know, this might be the corona in me talking. I've been saying I don't have a third, you know? We are waiting for, you know, we are waiting for, like, uh, Sumi to come out or something. Or I was like, you know what? If uh, what, Hinako, Hinako comes out, we get some memes going. Ramon's pretty cool. Now, you know, the one thing about 15 too is that the characters are bigger now, of course, because it's not like a sprite. So I feel like there's more personality. Not that not that old King of Fighters was lacking personality at all. But I feel like now with the close-ups, you know, the character close-ups... The more uh, clear voice lines and everything. I never thought he was cool before when he was kicking my ass, but he's kind of like, I guess like cheesy, you know? He's like a cool guy, but also like a kind of cheesy, like Joe, like Joe Higashi. I don't know. And if, if he's a scrub killer and I'm a scrub, if I could learn like infinite boxings and beat the beat the crap out of other like new players, you know I love doing that kind of stuff. I'm going to put him on the list. I'm going to put... I'm gonna put Ramon on the list here. I know he's a tricky character to fight, but is this stuff high execution? Is this high execution? I don't know. I feel like the blockchain infinite in the old one might have been, but this stuff, you know, specials. And you know 15, you know 15 is getting simplified all around too, like every other fighting game, so. This could be the chance. This could be like Strive, you know? Strive is a bunch of characters like Eno. You know, Eno is a character that in the old games were really cool and really technical, but it kind of turned people off. It's like, oh, she's too hard to play, but in Strive, she's easy. 15, as much as uh, some people want to be like, man, it's going to be hard. They're definitely going to make it easier to play. So older characters, it might have been a little bit rough. They might have been a little bit hard. You can pay him 15. Now, this might be my dude right now. There you go. Pretty cool stuff. Uh, the big news is we're getting more of the the non-main character teams, which is which is nice. So now that Ramon's in there, people are already predicting Team Mexico. So who do they say? Ramon, Angel, and who is it? Tizoc, people are saying. Is that... Is, Tizak is that's Team Mexico? I thought he was a Garo character. What the heck's going on? That was an old school team. Well, you never know. You never will come out in this one. But I'm not actually gonna cancel my pre-order uh, because I didn't even pre-order the game yet. It, can you even pre-order it? I don't even think you pre-order right now. I don't know. I'm still gonna play it. This will be fun, and I might actually consider picking him. We'll see. Of course, I need a strong team. I need easy to play character, top tier characters. What I want, but also since Kev's a three player or three uh, character game. Having like a gimmick, having like a gimmicky character like Ramon on there, that could be fun. That could be fun too. We'll see. But anyway, like always, if you're still watching, thank you. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know who you want to see on Team Mexico. If you're from Mexico, congratulations. I don't know how you say that. Congratulations. Saludo. And uh, I'll see you not next week because they cut down the character trailers. It's like one every two weeks now. So I'll see you in dos semanas, I think. But uh, like always, thank you. And uh, yeah, that's it. See you next one. Peace.